Yes. They don't hear. But in, in New York, I have a friend named Miss Grayson. And uh, Grayson's always profound. I love to hang around Grayson because he's profound. Anyway, he had said something when I was up there. He says, people have slash are falling in love with their diminished selves. People have or are falling in love with their diminished selves. I thought that was pretty profound. So I wrote it down on my, on the outside, my cover of my book here, you know. Grace and Challenger, heavy dude. And the fact, it got me to thinking because another thing, I got a book. Actually, I was just heavy, heavy, heavy that book here. Kindly said, thank you so very much. I appreciate it. Now, this is a book called The United Independent Compensatory Compensatory Code System Concept, a textbook workbook for thought, speech, and slash or action for victims of racism. Racism as defined by white supremacy. So it's the United Independent Compens Compensatory 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 is United Independent Compensatory Code System Concept. And I had read something in here because I'm going through the book. I read it like a, like a, you know, like a, well, I just open any page at night and I read it. I read it to my woman, the loose page there, and then I close it back up. So it's going to take me quite a while to get through this book. Anyway, this compensatory book. Compensatory, ah, compensatory is that when we're coming to a, a, a place of higher learning, you get it sooner than It's the United Independent Compen Compen Compensatory Code System Concept by Neely Fuller Jr. Anyway, he comes to this, and there's one part that he has here where you have, he has, he has this thing about power, four kinds of power. Uh, four basic types of power among the people of the known universe is what he says. They are all power, superior power, inferior power, and immediate power. I just want to talk about immediate power right now. Immediate power, the lack of will and slash or the lack of ability of non-white people to do anything of, com of comparative significance with or oh, I'm sorry, let me read that again. The lack of will and or the lack of ability of non-white people to do anything of comparative significance without the direct and or indirect force, approval, and or voluntary support of white supremacy, that's defined as racist, and or of white people in general. Now, Mr. Fuller uses the term, remember, this is, he's an American, this is only published in the United States of North America, so it's hard for anybody else to get it. So, since I'm in Africa, I have to make certain like, uh, adjustments because we're a whole bunch of Africans, so we don't really deal uh, with white people in general. But I call it colonialists. So if I was to reread this, it would be the lack of will and or the lack of ability of non-white people to do anything of comparative significance with or without uh, 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 indirect, the indirect force approval or the voluntary support of colonialists and or the colonial people in general. So that's that's it. So I feel a little thing, but you know, we're all learning. That nearly full of duty would say, you know, I'm still learning. So I'm learning how to read this. I'm learning how to talk to you. And that's because uh, this has been one of those uh, dispatches from the arts director in Murray. That that would be me, T, from the Pattersons, taking the trench to bed, letting you know what I only suspect.